Are you using the original version of the Windows? Well, certainly I don't. And I usually face this kind of problems where a site logo or a transparent logo appears on the right hand side of my windows and it says activate windows. Well, certainly it creates a lot of problem. My PC gets slow and I'm not really able to do my work fast as I usually be able to do in the activated windows. So what's the solution for this problem? Watch this video till the end so you know completely about the solution. So ladies and gentlemen, I am your friend Manish and you are watching Technical Charging. So let's get started with the video. So before I take you to my computer screen and show you that how easily you can activate Windows. So just a question to you and do comment below about this question that whether you are using the original kind of version of the Windows. If you are using the original version of the Windows, comment below yes. And if you're not using the original version of the window or maybe a Python version of Windows, comment no. So let me just take you to my computer screen right now. So you need to activate your windows. Over here you can see that activate windows, go to settings to activate windows is coming over here. But actually I want to download or doesn't want to use a full version of the windows. I will just using a Python version over here. And I will show you that how easily you can activate your windows and can use it the full version of your windows for that you need to go to start once you to start you need to go to press this gear icon which is of the settings once into settings you need to press it and you need to disable your windows defender walls so how you will do it you need to go to settings over here and let me just open up your settings once into settings, you need to go to update and security once press the update and security over here and once you do update and security you need to go to windows security press it once again and over here you're able to see the virus and threat protection you need to press it once you press the virus and threat protection it will open up a windows defender security center so over here again you need to press the virus and threat protection settings i'm pressing it so here you need to stop the real-time protection i'm turning it off and it will ask me that whether you should want to turn it off or not so i'm giving you just a permission to turn it off and moreover you have a cloud level protection if you want to protect data in the cloud so this is the automatic sampling which is submission turned on if you want to turn it off and save your bandwidth you can also do that of the cloud level protection and that turn it off so let me just go to my folder where i have already downloaded so it's the microsoft toolkit by graphic evolved and i'm just extracting it over here so as soon as you extract it you're able to see a new folder created on the downside so this is the Microsoft Office profession, press 2000 press activator, I'm not going to for that. I'm finding out a new folder. So this is the new folder over here on the downside, the Microsoft Toolkit by Graphic Evolve. I pressed it and once again, a new folder is created. And let me just open up that folder over here. Because if you not disable your real-time protection, it will just disable that your any sort of exe file over here and it will delete it automatically. I'm just pressing it over here and this is the application file and I will click on it and I will run it and I will show you before that here are the few readme first things which you should do run MS toolkit as an admin so right now you should be able to log in your admin if you want to run this toolkit and I'm giving it permission to yes I want to run it as an admin and it will open up over here so here you need to go for the readme first over here you will be able to see the steps which is we need to follow to make our windows fully activated so the my microsoft toolkit is actually already been open and you can click on the busy activator enjoy your activated products click on our voice and let me just straight go over for here so you need to press the windows icon this is the office icon next to that is the windows icon i'm pressing on the windows icon over here and windows icon is activated so now we have already click and install auto kws and you need to go for activation tab and you need to install this auto kws so i'm just pressing it is and it will start so auto kms it will start and you will see that couple of things overcome over here now i'm going for the activate front part i'm pressing it activate again it will take a couple of minutes to get the fully activated
and this thing over here will be just gone will be just disappeared after the full activation of my windows so this is the real thing which i'm showing you right now and over here you can able to see that it will be disappeared So as it says processing and other things have came, then it's been able to now process. Now what does the my steps takes? It takes that click on easy activator. Now click on easy activator. It will again go for the easy activator. Now you're able to see that activate windows is gone and my windows are now fully activated. So this is a short short thing that you should do if you doesn't want to purchase any product from the Microsoft. You can activate your office and even you can activate your windows. This is a full proof step which you should follow and can make your life very much simpler. It can work on a multiple pieces, multiple things. I've saved all this so you can have a link to that. That how easily you can be able to download this part and can do any sort of thing while activating the windows. So again it will take a couple of minutes and after a couple of minutes it will be just like okay thing will came so you will to see so now you are able to see a couple of green steps have came so now it's been fully activated so now I'm again turning back on my real time activation so real time activation is again on and I given a permission now my windows is fully activated and is now ready to use in my full version. So you have seen how easy it was to just take a couple of steps to activate your windows. Even with the help of that, you can also activate your Microsoft Office. Do comment below that whether you want to watch the video about activating the Microsoft Office or not. So if you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Don't forget to share this with your friends and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for such interesting videos. And I'll see you all in the next one.